Any saber from the Landless People Movement said the president should consider dissolving three of the newly established ministries as they have a budget of $9 million that could be put to good use. Look, let's cut three ministries that have been added additionally. The Ministry of Poverty, Eradication, uh, Public Enterprise, and also the additional one of, uh, uh, that was created. What we are saying is that those additional three ministries have added a nine billion bill to the debt. We are now nine billion that we are spending on them. We almost get, let's say, five billion from SACU. So basically what we are getting from SACU, we are just pumping it back into uh, payments uh, of high salaries and PECs for the senior civil servants. Sebeb added that government officials live off SNT and doesn't understand how a deputy minister is allowed to go to a different country for basic training rather than receiving the training in Namibia. This one month ban is nothing compared to what the president went to spend in USA. 30 days he went on a holiday promising to bring us investments back. Where are those investments today? Nothing. We had an expensive investors conference. What are the outputs? from that. Did we even attain or get a billion investment into this country? Nothing. So what he has done is basically not going to help anything. Sebib said this move by the president will not benefit Namibia's financial situation, stressing that this is just a drop in the pool of debt.